Hi, I'm Jared. Welcome to Fun Science Demos. The big idea today is that heat moves matter. Heat moves matter in this lamp, and heat moves matter in our Earth. So let's take a look at this lamp and see heat move matter. You can't see it, but there's a light bulb here, and it's hot. It gives off lots of heat, and that heat heats up this purple wax. You can see it, ooh, it causes it to rise to the top. When that wax gets hot, it rises to the top. And you can see some of the wax dropping down. Why? Well, as the heated wax moves to the top, it just hangs out there, and it's cooling off. And when it cools off, it drops. It drops back down, and when it drops back down, it gets heated back up and moves up. And it cools off and moves down. And it gets heated up and it moves up, and it cools off and it moves down. It's this cycle. It's happening in the lamp. And wouldn't you know, the same thing happens in our Earth. So let's take a look at this diagram and see how the Earth works. Through science, we've discovered that the middle of the Earth is really, really hot. We've also discovered that the outside of the Earth has this crust, and the moving matter inside the Earth can actually move the crust. As it's heated up, it rises up to the crust, it cools off and comes back down, just like this lamp, the wax in this lamp, it's happening inside of our Earth. The heat from the middle of the Earth is causing all this matter to move, and that makes the crust move. So let's take a look at that crust and the outside of the Earth. These are continents. That's where we live. The blue is the ocean. Oceans and continents actually sit on top of the crust. Well, what are these lines? Through science, we've discovered that the crust is actually broken into plates, and those plates move. Heat moves matter. Let's try and show you how that works. We have a heat source here. We have a heat source here. We have a heat source here. Our heat source is the middle part of the Earth. We need something to be the matter that that heat energy can move around. We have our milk. And now we need something to be the crust. For that, we're using chocolate powder. So here's our setup. We modeled it after our Earth. We have our center hot part. There's the heat source down there, making it hot. We have our crust, which you can see on the top. It's smooth right now. Something should happen as the matter, which you can't see, the milk, starts moving inside from the heat. Heat heats it up, rises, cools off, and sinks. There's movement happening. You can't see it yet. Let's zoom in and take a closer look. So our timer's going. Let's take a look at this setup and see what's going on here. Inside the pot, we have our liquid matter much like the Earth. And we're heating that liquid matter much like the Earth. And you can see the chocolate powder on top is our crust. It doesn't look like much is happening, but there's a lot going on underneath the crust, just like our Earth. So we're going to zoom in and take a closer look. But what should you be looking for? Well, that liquid matter under the crust is moving. It doesn't look like anything's happening to the crust, but as the liquid matter of the crust moves, the crust will start to move. And you'll actually see tiny cracks form, and those cracks will get bigger as the crust moves. So we're coming up on the 14 minutes, and now we can see our crust starting to crack. Why is that happening? Well, that liquid matter, we heated it up, and it's starting to move underneath the crust. And you can see that crust they're called plates. Scientists call those plates, and they're starting to move. Look at this one right here. Seeing it start to separate. Take a look at these plates as they move. Why are they moving? The liquid matter underneath is moving too. Take a look right here. And right here, tiny cracks in the crust. They're gonna the, the plates are going to start to move and you'll see the cracks get bigger. Watch right here. Watch it open up. Watch right here and right here. Ooh, there's one forming right here. Now we have a, a crack forming here. The crust is breaking in the plates right before our eyes. Why is that happening? The liquid matter underneath the crust is moving. Now we can start to see it happen. You can see the plate movements. As that liquid matter heats up, the crust, the plates move. Cracks are forming. 
we're at about 15 minutes in and now we can see our plates really forming up here beautifully we want you to remember that our continents and oceans actually sit on these different plates I'm not putting them in the right order but that's all right you get the picture each continent and ocean sits on different plates and you can see how the plates are separate by the cracks what causes it the moving matter underneath the crust we can't see it but through this demonstration now we can it's so easy to see the movement of the crust well scientists call that movement of the earth's crust plate tectonics it's a big word but so many cool things happen because of that word because the crust moves and those plates move we have earthquakes we have volcanoes and even it forms new mountains science is so cool don't forget to check out our links in the video description